Is it time to make some chimmy fucking chungus? Yes. Let's make some chimmy fucking chungus. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the next unboxing video. It's been a long time since we did one of these. Yeah. Um, and not necessarily because we haven't tried. Uh, we had tried and failed miserably. Technical difficulties. A lot of technical difficulties. Uh, anyway, I am Scott. This is Don Aquila. And uh, we got a quite a bit of boxes to open up here. Uh, yeah. We got the, I think, the episode three of the loot anime crate. I think that's how they're differentiating these, but I, I can't remember exactly. Um, we have our usual loot crate. Uh, that we got for this month and something different. Uh, we also have the nerd block. Uh, so, all right, maximum effort. Uh, where did you want to start, baby? Which which item? Let me go with both anime. Loot anime? Okay. Take the ceremonial dagger out. Oh boy. Woo. All right, I already see some awesome stuff here. Uh, is that a kill a kill? Yes. Kill a kill shirt. For all you perps, perps out there. It has to be white. <laughs> Damn it. This is the one time you're gonna have to wear white, babe. Because that won't fit me. That's a small. That ain't gonna fit me. I made sure I got the anime as women small. The loop one would have large for you. <laughs> Yeah, one of the changes that they made recently is it's actually guaranteed that every loot crate will have a t-shirt now. So, I guess they got tired of me bitching and moaning in the previous videos about not getting a t-shirt every time. But yeah, it's... There you go. Kill the Kill, uh, which is a series you've started. I haven't actually started watching it yet. I stopped at episode five because you, you wanted to watch it, so I stopped <laughs> So, so that's we, why I started watching. Watch that at some point. So I started watching other things. Got it. All right, so what's the next item here? <laughs> That's a tote. Oh. A Kame got killed. Oh, a Kame got killed. All right. So it has yeah. weapons of sorts. Interesting. Very, very interesting. That's going to go with my shirt. There you go. I don't think you want to use a tote. No, I am not a tote kind of guy. Messenger bags is probably the <laughs> closest thing you'll get to me wearing a purse. What's another phone charm? Oh, interesting. It is a very Japanese thing to have phone charms, so. Well, I guess that is used kind of commonly here in the States, too. I just don't know. Yeah, it says Luke people. Anime on the back of it. It has some sort of sword. Interesting. Very, very cool. A blue box. I do, I do like blue. Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate. Ooh. Now there's tape on my sword. <laughs> You wouldn't do it. You would love me too much. So I just blunt it. <laughs> it's like, the blade end is for business. The blunt end is for those you love. Oh, wow. You just learned something. That looks pretty cool. Oh, that's pretty wicked. I kind of recognize that blade, too. Wait, wait. Ah, ah, there's the pen. There's the pen. That's a tiny pen. And that does not look comfortable to wield. I think it's more of a novelty sort of thing. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I, I believe like that. Like the Sonic Spork that oh, yeah, um, yeah. Uh, that's yeah, it's not very practical to use the Sonic Spork, but it's still pretty funny to have nonetheless. You know what this reminds me of? Huh. Soul Calibur. A little bit. Of that uh, solar edge sword. Oh with yeah, the yeah, eye. yeah, with the eye. Yeah, I remember what you're talking about. It's missing the eye. It is. But yeah, pinball. Oh, is that a, it's one of the power level scanners. Oh, there's a game in there? I don't know. Yeah. Alright, let me see it. Wear sand scouter on your head. Okay. Let's make this happen. You gonna make it happen? I'm gonna make it happen. This is gonna be a thing. Twelve seconds later. How's this going? Oh, this twists around. Okay, there we go. I was like, how does that work? Oh, my head is way too big for this thing. <laughs> My head is way too big. This is this is for you. I, I my head's too big. Take the glasses off. She's blind now, by the way. <laughs> All right. So this is what you got to do now. You got to scream. It's over nine thousand. Okay, All right. So, so next item. It looks like gum. 
Hai Chu cherries. It's a cherry good. flavor. Is it gum? I don't know what it is. I know. Oh, hey, I was trying to find out. Open it. Oh my god. Got it. Yay, I get a piece. <laughs> with the wrapper. I'm going to find out exactly what this is with my mouth. How does that is? That's a good. Not gum. Oh, yeah, I see what you mean. It's like one of those uh, chewy type candies. Like a Starburst. That's very Starbursty. It's good though. I like it. <laughs> We're eating our loot. That's good though. It is good. I'm gonna check the strawberries. Um, yeah, we'd find out by now. <laughs> if there's a strawberries in it, I'd die. Hmm. What's it gonna look post there? Oh snap. That's pretty cool. Looks like Kill a Kill. The character right there. Or my misunderstanding. The blade doesn't look like it though. No, the blade's not a scissor blade. It's a high school girl. But I can't they tell what it's from. Oh, they got the info right there. And a... Looks like a manga. It is a manga. Oh, snip. What's it called? Dine's Gate. She's so busy looking at the loop that she forgets to actually show the camera. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited. <laughs> yes, and so it's number one. And I've got to start a series. <laughs> Man, it gets expensive. That's what happens when you get the loot. Yeah. Good, cool. Well, that's pretty much it. And then the box has a pretty awesome uh, sword design. Which, which is on the phone charm. Yeah. You so know what I've noticed? Cool. Hmm. The regular loot crates have the buttons. These animes have the phone charms. That's very interesting. Yep. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, put stuff back in here for now so we can open up the next crate. No disassemble. No Too late. No! Johnny Vine! If you're old enough to get that reference, you're my kind of people. <laughs> oh, you forgot the high chewy. Thought we could snack on it. If you want to snack on the high chewy while we do this, it's totally fine by me. <laughs> Nerdblock is a pretty cool uh, service. I'm more so interested in uh, the gaming box, but still, I think it's cool. I think the next Nerdblock one is Zelda. So I might just get that one. Yeah. That's right up my alley. I love me some Legend of Zelda. Okay, no fancy artwork on the box. Makes me sad, but that's understood. Looks like a t-shirt. Apparently, I'm being show, given the job of showing to the camera. Looks like a pretty wicked design. I'm not sure what it is, though. Uh, looks like a face of some sort. Maybe it's Kane. There you go. This is, a, what is it, Goober from... That's the ghost from... Uh... From Ghostbusters, yeah. yeah. Goober, I think it is. This is his name. I'll probably be corrected in the comment section below. Uh, but yeah, Goober from uh, Ghostbusters. Again, if I get that name wrong, just comment down below how much of a loser uh, I am. Poster of, I don't know what it is. Um, God, it looks very familiar too. We're terrible nerds, by the way, if you have not noticed already. Uh, God, I want to say, I, I know one of these. I can't think of the other one on panel. I don't know what it is. Yeah, I'm not sure either. It looks like a, almost like a Dracula sort of thing, but it's not really Dracula. Yeah, I don't know, it's strange. It's a Buffy pop thing figure. Oh, yeah, okay. This is Spike, which was Buffy's love interest for a little while. The vampire Spike. He was a vampire, right? I think he was. Yeah. 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 This is cool. Monte Python's uh, magnet. Oh, and all the words are individually. Yeah. That's funny. And it's the silly Ministry of Silly Walks. <laughs> okay, I like this one. I just spin! 
Spam, 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 spam. And it's all in one row. Spam, 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 spam. Okay, this is pretty cool. This is pretty cool. This is a dead parrot. It's no more. It ceases to be. Oh, each line, each. Oh, this is funny. Each line is from. Is from the Monty Python. Yeah. Each line is something from either the show or one of the movies. Yeah. That's pretty cool. No I like one it. expects the Spanish Inquisition. Nobody expects the Spanish Inquisition. <laughs> okay, this is pretty cool. From Kevin Smith called Tough Shit. And uh, we don't censor on this show, so obviously we just say it. Uh, life advice from a fat, lazy slob who did good. So, there you go. But it's actually not bad. I mean, I like Kevin Smith and his work, so... That's pretty cool that it actually comes with a book, which I think these books usually go for like about a good 15, 20 bucks. Uh, it doesn't say on here, but it's very interesting. So, and who doesn't love Kevin Smith, right? Uh, so now we're actually gonna open up the loot crate, which has always been very entertaining and awesome. So you wanna use the ceremonial dagger. I suppose. Yes, we're gonna open the loot crate. <laughs> it's the uh, dead crate, so it's gonna have stuff from both The Walking Dead and Deadpool. Uh, so it should be a nice little uh, combination of stuff. Ooh, keep pop Deadpool. Oh snap! Here we go. Oh, that's cute. This one's large, so that one's. No, oh, it's for me. So I, I thought that one was gonna be Deadpool. So I got that one small. So. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's okay. Now I feel all bad. I'm gonna end up jacking her Deadpool well, shirt. Well, I, I had one from Comic Con, so. That's true. That's true. So there you go. I don't know what it says. You'll have to read it out. It says tacos. <laughs> tacos? Why does it say tacos? Because he's saying tacos. He loves tacos. I thought he loves chimichangas. Well, no, I know he doesn't love chimichangas. He just likes the word. Interesting. All right. Well. In the video game, he saves the tacos. You always have to save tacos. Tacos rule. And if you save up, uh, if you save a certain number of them, you get the achievement called Savior of Tacos. <laughs> she knows her Deadpool. Admittedly, she's probably the bigger Deadpool fan <laughs> than me. I just, I really loved the film. That was pretty much it for me. So the pin uh, looks like a zombie something. A zombie something. Okay, so she wants nothing to do with it. Uh, well, that's the pin for the crate. It looks like a zombie building. Or like maybe a zombie box. It's very cubish. I don't know how well that'll come off on the camera, but yeah, it's kind of weird, but all right, cool. Let's go ahead and move on. Okay, well, I think it's one of those little mystery things where you have to open it up to find out what's in it. Um, in fact, actually, it even blatantly says uh, contents one of three. So let's go ahead and open it up and find out. Uh, it is a Loot Crate exclusive. So that's pretty cool. And I assume that if you don't get the one you want, you could buy more. Uh, Cause they kind of started doing that a little bit. Oh. Um, Six and a half hours later. Uh, it looks like pieces of a figure. Let's see, which one is this? Oh, um, God, it's the cop. What's the cop's name? God, crap. It's basically, you build him up, but it's a little builder. I believe that's the cop who has the son. He's always screaming, ah! I don't watch The Walking Dead. You can put your hate for that down in the comments section below and tell me how much of a terrible person I am. I'm, like I said, I'm not a, a huge fan of The Walking Dead. I don't so. do zombies. Yeah, you don't do zombies at all. I love zombies. I just, uh, to be honest, I haven't even watched the show. I should give the show a chance. Soap on a rope and ears. I should be excited for this, I guess. <laughs> it's funny. I, I don't get the reference, but it's definitely funny. Would you use soap? Daryl Walk Daryl's Walker's ear necklace. Oh, uh, okay. So this That's is the reference. Yeah, Daryl's necklace then. Oh, we're gonna get so much hate on this for not knowing this stuff. We just wanted the Deadpool stuff, okay? And of course the Little booklet, the crate. No, the, with the stuff that's in there. Yeah, that's pretty cool. All right. And tizzle. Okay. Pretty minimal. Uh, not the best. 
concrete that we've got, and of course the graphic naturally here. It has so, zombies in it. Yeah, I know, I know. Like I said, you know, the funny thing is is that I, I'm not a big Walking Dead fan, and it's not necessarily that I, because I don't like the show, I've just never actually given it the time to watch it. I'm not a big TV guy, so that's part of the problem. They do have uh, awesome Telltale games, which I should probably take a look at at some. I know where he's going. He's going? He's going on my computer disc. Ah, uh, it's a good place for it. So I'm going to assume that's obviously your favorite part of that crate. Yeah. Yeah. Would have been sure. Would have been sure if it was in my size instead of hers. That's pretty uh, awesome. The shirt definitely is my favorite part. Well, I'm gonna wear that. I don't know why. You'd have to have a Deadpool shirt. I got one that he says, did someone say Jimmy Chowers? No. So he now you got one that says Tacos. More of a burrito guy, but reach their own. It's still an awesome shirt. Um, so yeah, there we go. That was all three crates that we opened in fairly quick fashion. Um, I, I felt that the anime crate probably had the most fan service type stuff in it. Uh, the Nerd Block one was pretty good. I think Nerd Block actually gave you a better value of stuff uh, because of the the uh, plushie that it came with and then, of course, the uh, Kevin Smith book. So, I mean, that's pretty cool. I mean, the fact that you actually have a, a fully readable book inside of the crate, that's pretty cool. Well, anime had the manga. Anime did have the manga. Absolutely. So, you know, that kind of trumps that. <laughs> <laughs> manga could be cool. But you're going to have to start a series now. That's a complete book. You got the first episode. Still good. <laughs> it is. <still> good. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I, I felt like the anime crate probably had better stuff than everything else. And don't get me wrong, I mean, I love the Deadpool stuff. That was pretty wicked. Um, but I think because we're not huge fans of The Walking Dead, you know, obviously like this kind of stuff, it didn't quite appeal to us as it would for a fan. Um, which again, I mean, I'm sorry, we're just not huge Walking Dead fans. It's just, it is what it is. Either way, I thought all three boxes were pretty good. Uh, let us know in the comment section below what you liked the most and, uh, you know, give us some heads up as to what items maybe made you decide to get yourself like a nerd block or a loot crate. Uh, I like both services. And like I said, I think nerd block actually gives you a better value for the items that you get. Uh, but the big thing about loot crate is that because of the exclusive items, this is stuff that you can't get elsewhere. Uh, so that's pretty cool. But anyway, it's good to finally actually do one of these videos and hopefully it works out. Uh, we haven't edited this yet, obviously, because we're recording it. So we'll figure out when uh, we get to that point. And uh, if you like the video, be sure to give that thumbs up a click. If you didn't like the video, yeah, go ahead and click the thumbs down. It doesn't really matter to me. I'd rather you guys be honest. Uh, again, leave a comment in the comment section below if you like a specific item or if you want us to do something a little different or however you uh, want to give us any form of feedback. All looks acceptable. Our cats are having a lot of fun right now in the living room and it's very distracting. So, sorry about that. Uh, <laughs> and of course, if you want to see more videos, be sure to click that subscribe button. It helps us out a ton and uh, it'll give you more content from us, whether it's by us playing video games or our podcast, GetCast or Get OTC, all that fun stuff. So, and with that said, we are officially out of here. Have a good one. Tanakila, please don't stab me at the end of this video. No, Deadpool's gonna stab you. No! That was a terrible way of ending the video, by the way. And I loved it. I loved every <laughs> second of it.